Hi, and welcome to A Tough Cell. Now this is a little game that I found on Game Jolt, where you play as the evil queen from the Snow White uh, story. And you have to convince her to eat the poison apple. Because you know, Disney villains are just misunderstood. They're just super misunderstood and the evil queen just wanted to kill her stepdaughter and we have to help her. Uh, anything I should know? Tutorial. Talking to Snow White is simple. Type whatever you you wish to say and hit enter. If you're being convincing, her trust her trust meter. <laughs> okay, so there's trust. She might not understand everything you say, so probably no cursing. To put all your chances on on your side, keep your sentences simple and short. If you feel stuck, take notice of what she talks about. Fair enough. You can also ask her questions. Okay. After a while, we'll grow, she'll grow bored, and she'll send me on my way. Okay, let's play. Hello, young lady. Hi, what brings you to this neck of the woods? Just selling apples. This apple does look tasty, but I'm afraid I couldn't eat food coming from a stranger. I'm not a stranger. Stranger. Well, in fact, you are. Well, let me introduce myself. Well, my name is Granizzle. My name is Snow White. Nice to meet you. Hello. Yo. I'd love to keep chat. Okay, she's um, she's a kind of shooing me away. Um, do, do you want them apples? No thanks, I don't trust you enough. Okay, but apples are so healthy. It's true that apples are healthy. Go on, take one. I still don't trust you enough to eat that, okay? How are you? You're quite the greeter. Yeah, I'm super polite for an evil queen trying to kill you. What's the matter? I'm sorry to be like that, but I just can't accept anything from anyone. Why not? Because strangers have tried to kill me recently. Why? It was my stepmother in disguise. She's jealous of my beauty. You don't say. Who the hell would do such a thing? Why? Okay. Sorry. <laughs> Why what again? Um, your stepmother, your stepmom, sounds like a really nice, well, horrible person. Are you here to insult me? No, I'm insulting myself. Your stepmom sucks. That's it. I'm out. <laughs> That's it. I'm out. <laughs> no, don't go. <laughs> oh, she left already. Damn it. I failed in killing her, but we can restart. Hello, young lady. Would you like some apples? Oh, I'm not typing. Would you like some delicious apples? It does look delicious. Um... So do you... do... do you want some? Do you some? I really... okay. Nice change of su subject there. Why is your... Stepmom, so sucky. Apparently, my stepmother's jealousy of my beauty. Apparently, my stepmother's jealous of my beauty and wants to kill me for that. Yeah, I heard. So, do you have a boyfriend? No, living in constant fear of death wrecks havoc on your love life. Yeah, tell me about it. Are you alone? 
You can hardly feel lonely living with seven dwarves, but it's true that I sometimes long for human company. So are you calling dwarves not human? Jeez, so racy. What's it like to live with seven men? It's a bit strange living with seven men half my size, but you get used to it. Are the dwarves treating you nicely? They've offered me food and lodging and saved me when my stepmother tried to kill me. The dwarves sound okay. I really trust the dwarves and they've told me not to talk to strangers. Well, I'm not a stranger anymore. Snow White, you might want to answer. Well, in fact, you are. Come on, I introduced myself as Grand Nizzle. Do you... No. I need the money from the apples. My life is more important to me than any amount of money. Way to talk about only yourself, man. Without... With... Mm, without apple money, I won't be able to buy medicine Medi medicine excuse me but who are you again oh my god you are so stupid no wonder I I mean your stepmom wants to kill you do you want me to die I'm usually very friendly but in the circumstances it's hard for me to trust anyone you should trust me. Sorry, but what was it that you wanted again? I just need money. I understand that. Here. Oh, she gave me a gold coin. Cheers. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hi. Jesus. She's, um, she's got that goldfish memory. Well, let's take advantage of that. She's almost trusting me, though. So that's, that's good. Um, how about them apples? Are you here to see the dwarves? Yes. Oh, they're out at the moment. Where are they? They're digging the mountain for ore. Aren't you lonely? I hate to be rude, but there's an okay. So she's kind of shooing me away again. Are you happy? I can't think straight with all this stress. Well, problems with stress. Better, better get some apple in ya. Apples are great for stress. I'm going- no, don't- don't you- don't you deny this delicious looking apple. Have my apples excuse me but who are you to be offering apples to strangers i'm a door to door apple sales person i don't think that anyone here called for a salesperson you must have the wrong house no one calls for a salesperson they just show up i sell apples to buy medicine for my evil ness. This apple does look tasty. I can't eat food coming from a stranger. Your mother would want you to eat some apples. No thanks. You know, I was like you once. Alone, frightened, living with seven other men. But then, I found apple trade. And my life changed forever. Aw, you're welcome. 
<gasps> she trusts me. Have this apple. The apple seems nice, but I wouldn't risk my life for generic fruit. What? But it's organic. It's true that apples are healthy. Have it. Yes! Alright, I'll take a bite, a bite of this apple. Oh, you vile woman, I'm too young to die. The dwar dwarves will think I'm dumb. Congratulations, you've murdered an innocent woman to satisfy your vanity. Yes! I am the best villain ever. Only took me two tries. Yay! Well, this was a fun little game. You should definitely try it out yourself. Maybe you can get some more fun conversations out of it. I've been the Evil Queen. I'll see you in the next game.